Verizon has been ranked number one in shit. Verizon doesn't even pick up where I live, man. I use bluegrass cellular. Fucking. Oh my uh, god, I'm not the only person with beer as a clan tag, and they got beer in their name. That's hot. Oh, it Oh my god, I swear to god. Alright guys, so we're here on Black Ops 2 again. So I've done one of these videos before on both Modern Warfare 3 and Black Ops 1. Uh, and I wanted to go on other Call of Duties and see what I had in theater mode. You guys know that Black Ops 2 is my least played Call of Duty. So for the longest time, I didn't even check my theater mode. But I decided to get on today and check it just to see if by some miracle, I had some kind of old gameplay there that I could share with you guys that would be kind of interesting. Uh, so I went to theater mode and I went to select films, went through my recent games, recent victories, films, and then I went to edited films. I actually have a clip from November 27th, 2012, 5 p.m. So this clip was on my old gamer tag, X Street Dreams X. It was years ago. This is four years ago when I was 16 years old. Um, shoot, when did Black Ops, when did even Black Ops 2 come out? I'm actually going to look this up real quick. When did a Black Ops 2 come out? Out. I know it's in November. It came out November 13th, 2012. So that is 14 days after this game came out. So two weeks after this game came out, I finally put up a clip. So we're going to go. We're going to watch it together. Um, I can't even tell what weapon that is. It looks like there's a ballistic CPU on there. Uh, so it could be a sniping clip. Uh, this Call of Duty is a Call of Duty that I was sniping a lot in because one of my most used weapons before the M27 was the Ballista, I think. So I did snipe quite a bit on this. So let's see what this clip is and let's see uh, let's see what my skill level was like when I was 16 years old. Yeah, so it is a sniping clip. So we had some slow-mo and some quick scoping. So we get the two-piece. Do we pick up the third? Oh, we pick up the three-piece. Oh, please don't tell me we turn on this kid. Dude, my sniping skills for being 16 weren't that bad. I kind of wish I would have acted on them, and uh, I kind of wish I would have started to make YouTube videos back in the day. Uh, but that is the only clip I have, so I do apologize about that, guys. Uh, there's really nothing else I can share with you guys, uh, just for the simple fact that that is my only clip. So we're gonna go into just some regular TDM. I uh, got a couple things I wanna talk about, some things I wanna ask you guys and whatnot. So I'll catch you guys when we join into a match. All right guys, so we got a hijack. So this is gonna be a good, why is everyone around level 20 on my team? Okay, so this is a good map to snipe on. So we're probably gonna do a game or two. I can't promise that the sniping is gonna be amazing guys because uh, I haven't warmed up or anything. So, um, Basically, I just want to talk about, like, kind of, oh, my God. Oh, fuck my life, bro. Um, <laughs> I just want to talk about, like, why this Call of Duty was my least played and uh, just some other things. So, this game, I just got destroyed. Okay, we're, we're not using the DSR. It's too slow. But, uh, so... Black Ops 2 is my least played Call of Duty, and that's not because I didn't like it. It's because, like I've said multiple times, guys, uh, a lot of my friends in high school really didn't play this game. And that honestly isn't an excuse. Oh, nice. Uh, isn't an excuse because um, one of my best friends in high school who actually gave me his old Elgato, is, uh, he actually played this game for like two straight years. So I really wish I would have played it back then with him. Uh, because I feel like I would have enjoyed this game a lot more. I really only... What is what C4, man? What? Uh, because playing this game solo, that's what I did for a little bit. Was when this game first came out, I was playing it solo. Oh, dude, if we could have picked him up. This purge snipe kid, he's going to be a... He's going to be a problem. But, uh... Oh. Oh. Why? Why? What? You gotta be joking me. How did that miss? Alright, but, uh... So, yeah, really, I, I should have played this game more, guys. I feel like I missed on missed out on a golden Call of Duty. I've said that so many times. Uh, but, for everyone that's new, I just wanted to say that. 
God, I suck. <laughs> but uh, what is your guys' favorite Call of Duty? Favorite Call of Duty to snipe on? Favorite Call of Duty to uh, just play in general? Watch this, this guy's dead. Uh, I just wanted to know, my personal favorite, guys, is definitely Modern Warfare. Modern Warfare 2, and that's just because the maps just were so good, in my opinion. Uh, the maps were good, the snipers were good, I mean, you got the intervention. Oh, we're straight spawn trapping. Oh, that was it. The maps were good. The intervention was freaking beautiful. Uh, freaking those when t when COD was simpler. Those were simpler times, guys, and that's kind of why I miss them. And that's why I really hope one day they bring back Modern Warfare 2. Uh, I really don't even care about supply drops. Like I know so many people complain that in Modern Warfare Remastered there's supply drops. Uh, in all honesty, guys, I would not care if there were supply drops in that game because I just want my old Call of Duty back. But with Boots on the Ground coming to COD in 2017, I, that, that is just what we need, guys. That is what we need. Call of Duty being back on the ground is what is going to revive Call of Duty. I tweeted a picture out of Modern Warfare 2's numbers, or not Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 3's numbers, and I showed that there was 22 million accounts that have played a public match. 22 million, guys. So if you think about it, uh, Oh my god, I suck. 22 million accounts on Modern Warfare 3 back in... I can't even remember the date that it came out. That fucking is stupid. I wanted my visa. Um, 22 million accounts. If you look at Modern Warfare Remastered, there's about 4 million accounts. I think like 4.5 million accounts that have, been, that have played a public match. So with 4.5 million accounts down... Or no, 22 million down to 4.5 million. That that's a huge decrease. That that is not good, uh, and it's even worse on Infinite Warfare because Infinite Warfare refuses to show the correct number of people. You can only make an estimate though, and if you go off of what a lot of people, I've actually talked to a lot of people and asked them, have you played Infinite Warfare or like after they bought Modern Warfare Remastered. And a lot of people literally only bought Infinite Warfare because they wanted Modern Warfare Remastered. So think about it. If 4.5 roughly million people bought Modern Warfare Remastered just for Infinite Warfare, then the numbers would be even lower for Infinite Warfare. Uh, even if you think about it like this, Infinity War will only show the top 10,000. If you're not in the top 10,000, you're not showing up on the leaderboard, and that's all they show, which is dumb. It should always be the correct number of people like they did back in the day. So that, that actually kind of bums me out that they aren't showing the correct number anymore, and that just kind of shows that Call of Duty as a whole has just gone down. And I've seen it throughout my time played as well, guys. So, like... Back in the day, I would jump on Call of Duty day in and day out just to play it. Back when I was a little kid and everything. Like, now I'm 20. I was, like, when I first started playing Call of Duty, I was roughly, I want to say, it's probably, like, 12 or 13. I was in, like, 7th or 8th grade when I really started playing Call of Duty all the time. And that was mainly, that, that was just the time when everything was simple. Call of Duty was booming. Call of Duty was thriving. It was, like, the number one game every single year. Um... Uh, for like a first person shooter or whatnot it had no competition with battlefield like this year battlefield got very very close to outselling it uh it unfortunately didn't and i believe battlefield is still a very very good game it's just i, I want to see call of duty back to where it was and it's never going to get back there but i think with a boots on the ground call of duty it's going to bring back a lot of older generation players it's just going to bring back the community as a whole and I really don't agree with a remastered edition like right off the bat. Because I feel like that just splits the community. If you look at um, Modern Warfare Master and Infinite Warfare, that, that's a prime example. Like I said, 4.5 roughly million accounts have played a public match on that game. And it's probably even lower on Infinite Warfare. So I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. Sorry that it kind of was just kind of off topic and a whole bunch of rambling. But I uh, hope you guys looked past that, heard what I had to say. And uh, let me know your feedback down in the comment section below, guys. I try to respond to all my comments as much as I possibly can because, uh, you know, if you guys are taking your time out of your day to comment something, I'm going to try to respond with something. So let me know down in the comment section below if you guys think that Boots on the Ground Call of Duty is what we need to return Call of Duty back to its state. It's never going to be back to the state of having, like, 
30 million players, but you never know, guys. Like, having a boots on the ground COD could bring everything back and make it all fall into place. So, like I said, hope you guys did enjoy today's video. Don't forget to like. Let's shoot for 500 likes on today's video. And uh, catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Boop.